Hi, this is Peggy, Sunday School's teacher at Lifeway Church, and I'm going to bring a little message for our Sunday morning Sunday School. This is an Easter egg. I'm sure you guys knew that from the picture, but is this what Easter is really all about? Is it about Easter eggs? We're gonna look inside some Easter eggs and we're gonna find out. The bunny! Is that what Easter is all about? The Easter bunny? No. That's a part of the fun celebration, but it is not what Easter is all about. Getting an Easter basket! No. That's not what Easter is all about. That is fun too. And it's a part of the celebration because you're getting something new and you're celebrating. The Bible. This is what Easter is really all about. God's word, God's promises, and what he was gonna do for a world full of sin. People do bad things. People do things that are wrong. We all need somebody to help us. And God saw what was going on inside of the world. And through his prophets, he wrote many, many scriptures that foretold that he was going to come to the earth as a baby. He was going to live among men. And that one day he was going to die and rise again. And in that rising again, there's hope for us. Hope that we have a future. Because when we die like he died, then we will become like him and be resurrected. The Bible promises that to us. So, when Jesus was alive and was a baby, he grew. And when he grew up, there were some people who did not like Jesus. They were mean to him, but it was all part of God's plan from his Bible. He had a plan that was already wrote, that was already talked about inside the scriptures. In his plan, those people decided to mock him and pretend like he was their king. But really, he is the king of all kings, the Lord of all lords, and he is going to come back someday for us. This is a crown made out of thorns. The mean people put that on Jesus' head. They hit him, they buffeted him, that means they hit him really hard, and they took some rope, and they had them on the end of a cord, and they hit him on his back and hurt him. But all that hurting, all that bruising was for us. Jesus went on the cross, he died for our sins. He took all of your sicknesses. He took all the diseases. He took all the bad things that you have ever done. And he had them on the cross with him when he died. And when he died, that was a way for us to be able to connect, to reach him. Because he brought heaven down to earth so that we could become a part of who he really is. His power, his glory, his majesty. And because he went to the cross and the prophecies inside of our Bible, it promised that he would rise again. Three days he laid inside of a grave and on the third day, according to the prophecies in the book of the Bible, he came out and he is alive. God is alive so that you can be alive. So you can have the saving power where God would take away all the bad things that you have ever done, all the sins that you have ever committed, and he will fill you full of his Holy Spirit, full of his Holy Ghost inside of your heart. You just repent, be baptized in the name of Jesus, and you will receive the gift of the Holy Ghost, His Spirit inside of your heart. Have a great Easter. 
I miss you, Lifeway kids. See you soon.